picking up from where we left off in tutorial number 10. This tool here is the video note tool. You can type notes for your video that you can refer back to and edit at later dates. This tool here is the snapshot tool. When a video is paused and you have visual aids in place, you can take a snapshot of the frame by touching this button. You can title the snapshot and add notes here. When you touch Done, the video note appears in this bottom queue. You can email snapshots from the app by touching the email icon here. We covered these buttons, the Record and Pause buttons, in Tutorial 9. This tool is the Delay Recording tool. Touching it starts a countdown before the app starts to record. The toggle bar here controls the length of the countdown. These buttons are the SRV functions or screen recorded video functions, and we cover these in a later tutorial. This is the stopwatch tool. The clock can be relocated, and to reset it to zero, double tap the clock. Note that the clock keeps precise time, whether the video plays at normal speed, slow speed, or even in frame by frame. These last two buttons are the video trim tools. Touch the scissors to activate the trim tool on the video progress bar. Any video between the grab bars will be trimmed. Slide the grab bars by grabbing these nodes and dragging to the appropriate trim spots. Press this button to execute the trim. Note that the new trim clip is added as a new clip to the video queue here. The original clip is still intact here. You can place multiple trim tools by touching the scissors multiple times. To remove the trim tools, hold your finger on the tool and then touch the red minus sign. In the next tutorial, we will cover the side-by-side -side and video overlay buttons here, in addition to this section of the analysis screen.